Hello YouTube, Coin Capital here, and today in this video, I'll be talking about a godless note. What is a godless note? Are they any more valuable? And uh, why is it a godless note? Why is it called that? Well, the godless note in the $1 bill category is the nine, all 1935 series notes. This right here is a 1935E. It's actually a silver certificate, which as you can see, it's, it's a deposit for silver, and these were payable for like, you can exchange them for silver coinage. And that's the whole point of a silver certificate. But this right here is called the godless note. You wanna know why? Well, if we flip it over on the back, in all modern notes right here on the one dollar bill, it says, in God we trust. If you look here, we have a very modern note. It's actually a star note, but it says, in God we trust right there. And also if we look at a, right here's a 1957 silver certificate. So you can see it says in god we trust so that's the whole deal with the godless note they really don't carry much more of a premium it's more of a pretty cool novelty historical fact see right here's a 1935 denver uh not denver <laughs> 1935 b uh godless note we also have the 1935 f as you can see it's all 1935s that have that right there there's a few examples right there and uh, they're called godless notes because they are lacking the in God we trust. Um, that's just how the design was at the time. And then they added it back. And uh, that's the name, the godless note. So other than that, they don't carry much of a premium. They're good to look out for. They're pretty fun fact. Uh, cool, you know, fact uh, that you have with your bills. But other than that, they're worth the price of a silver certificate in the condition for a $1 small size note. Right here, it's probably worth about maybe two dollars, if that. And uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. So, thanks for watching. Share this video with your friends. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. See you all in the next video.